The blade must ever feed if her edge is to remain keen. Butcher. What care you for these worthless creatures? They are nothing. Weak from the moment of their conception, ever longing for power not theirs to command, they turn unfailingly upon themselves. Like sheep, they roam in filthy flocks, eager to trample those few gifted a fleece of gold. Or that they might feel contentment with their pitiful existence. Prejudice and persecution, severance and strife, every earthly wrong springs from the malice in men's hearts. Malice born of the pain and suffering that is free will. Its corruption is gnawed at your being from the very moment of your birth. You're wrong. It is no corruption. It is who I am. Every choice I make, right or wrong, gives me reason to carry on. And carry on I shall. Not as a puppet, but as a man. Which are you? <laughs> there was a time I too thought those the only choices. What? Long ago, God granted man the gift of magic. And with that gift did he build great civilizations. Yet over time, man lost sight of the gift's true meaning. Stepping from the path of shared prosperity to one of avarice. He abandoned his creator for sword and flame, and through his folly, beckoned the blight. Yet, there were those few who refused to turn their eyes from the heavens. And they prayed to God that he might lead them back to righteousness. And the Lord, he did answer. Before the worthy shall the gates of paradise open. And so did I spread my arms to the ether and cast my soul upon its gentle waters. I gave myself unto him. Proven, the Lord charged me thus. If your kind are to find salvation, they must be made to serve. You see, paradise lies but a single step away. Could we only take it? Could we only leave our transgressions behind? For none save the pure of heart and mind may set foot in the new world. I will save us. But it all begins and ends with you. You are the key, Mythos. And with this humble offering shall I prove my faith once more. So you forsook your kingdom. You forsook yourself to serve. Tell me, how is that living? <laughs> What you seek to provide is not salvation. It's anything but. Life is about always having a choice. Take that away, and we might as well be dead.
Very well. Come then. Show us the strength of your will. It's not the strength of my will that should worry you. But the weakness of yours. his vessel, and you cling to this foolish notion of hope, when there is none.
Sure. 
is at an end. And we both know the truth. It is I who stand victorious. My will that prevailed. Your will? No. It was his. Clive Rossfield.